What's up, YouTube, and welcome back to another episode of It's Food, Dude. So Easter is next Sunday, and I'm super excited. And so in honor of Easter, I'm going to be doing this super easy, simple cupcake tutorial. This you can do it with your kids. You can do it by yourself. It's really straightforward, and it's not really difficult like some of my other cupcake slash cake videos. So give it a try, see if you like it, and let's get started with the video. So the first thing I'm going to do is start lining my cupcake pans with cupcake liners. When that's finished, go ahead and add your cupcake batter. I'm just using your regular Betty Crocker mix from the cake aisle. Now for the decorating, you're going to want green buttercream. I got this at Walmart. It was about $3 and I'm just going to fill my piping bag with my green buttercream and I'm gonna make sure I have a grass tip at the end. Now that we have our pastry bag ready, you're gonna start in the middle and you're gonna pipe really hard and then pull up. It's kind of like an up and down motion but if you don't pipe really hard at the bottom, then it won't look like grass. So here's a closer look if you're kind of confused. Just notice how I'm starting at the bottom and I'm pulling up so it can look like grass. And for these cupcakes, I also got these sugar bunnies at Walmart. You can find these in the cake decorating aisle or the Easter section. But I'm just going to put one on each cupcake. And I'm also going to put these mini eggs on my cupcakes as well. do this with cookies as well just start off with about two tablespoons of cookie dough and then just put that at the bottom of your cupcake liner and make sure everything is evenly pressed so this is what it should look like and once you finish baking your cookies it should only take about 10 minutes and then you're just going to use a spoon to scoop those out of your muffin tin so just like how we did the cupcakes, you're going to start at the bottom and squeeze really hard and then pull up to make your grass. Once I finished with that, I added these cute little flower sprinkles I got from Michael's and I'm just going to put that on my grass too. If you want, you can also add some eggs like how I did, but you can customize your cookie baskets however you'd like. And here's all of our treats. They came out super adorable. Thank you everybody for watching. If you liked it, give it a fat thumbs up, a juicy thumbs up. You can subscribe to my channel. You can comment below. And see you in the next video. Bye. Happy Easter.